All right, what's going on guys? It's your boy Zilchi and welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duo video. Today's video, we're going to be using some more Drytrons. I think I'm going to be using it until I get to Plat 1. You might see a lot more um, Drytron videos than the... Plus, they do really well on the channel and you guys want to see me use it a lot. So, so that way you guys could learn some combos and stuff. I know that in some of these videos, I don't always make the right decisions when I use the deck. But sometimes, you gotta understand, in the heat of the moment, <laughs> you don't always make the right decision. But usually, most of the time, still work out. And the combos are still... If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button, comment, share, subscribe, and let's go on into the matches. Okay, so. I don't really have a great hand. It's not the best, but we can make some plays. We're gonna need to. Okay, well, it looks like he can ash. Oh, Maxi. Well, we're gonna ash that Maxi. <laughs> oh, we don't want him to draw anything. We'll ash it. Ash that. Perfect. There's no reason to use the Herald. Okay, we're gonna bring out the Zeta. I think. Zeta's the right decision, right? Or do we want the Alpha? No, we need the Zeta. We're gonna bring the Zeta. Hold on, we have to think carefully about this because we could get the Alpha, then bring the Ultiminus. Maybe I'm overcomplicating this for no reason. Let's do this. Okay, then we go into the Link Karibo, which is actually the actual MVP of this deck. Like, actually, you guys don't understand. <laughs> that card comes in clutch a lot of times, but yeah, we'll go here. Should we you? Oh, he has an Ash. It's a situation like this where I'm going to need to negate that. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Okay. Should be good. Oh, he probably thinks that we can't do anything from here, but it's still fine. We have the Diviner that we're about to grab. Okay, grab the Diviner. Go to normal summon. I'm gonna send the Herald. And what can we add to the hand? What do we want to send? Do we want another Ben 10? Or do we want this? We might want another Ben 10 so that way we can add. No, we'll, we'll add this, I think. And that's the better play. But let's add this so that we can just have at least... At least two negates. Go here. Special summon you. Okay, we have to make really smart plays here. I wish he didn't let us get rid of our heralds like that of the orange light, but what can we do? It's either we do something this turn or we just let him OTK us next turn, right? So I think this is the better place. Now we can send. I'm gonna send the Gamma. Okay. I almost sent that. That's crazy. I almost sent that to the graveyard because I'm just so used to doing that play, right? So we're gonna send the Gamma. Activate you. Go here. Honestly. Now that I'm really thinking about it, we should have added the Ben 10 to the hand. Honestly. Go here. Okay, we're going to the Mew Beta. What do we send? Go here. We'll send you, right? Now, if we wanted to, I don't think that's the play, though. We'll wait till the next turn to make that play, right? Okay, then we'll go into the ultimateness. We have no, so at least we'll have 
two negates. We'll have two negates. Next turn. I probably could have done this play a lot better. But it happens. It happens. Actually. I think this is better. Right? Then we add the Ben 10. So we'll have three negates. Just in case. Okay, okay, okay. We're making plays. And do I want... Now the thing is, do we go into Mask Arena? I don't think we do. We could. Should we? Yeah, let's do it. We'll go into the Mask. Okay, no I can't. Well, I'm not going into the Mask. <laughs> Alright, we'll toggle on so that way when he draws, we just send the Eva to the graveyard. Okay. Mm hmm. We activate the Eva. Now we're gonna add the two. Vanish you two. Please don't have called by the grave. Oh, thank you. One. Two. Alright, perfect. Now we're looking really good. Let's see what he does. I don't think he can do anything here. Well, I lied to you guys. He had a Caillou the whole time. What are the odds that he drew into a Caillou? You know what I mean? So what can he do? Should I negate that? He normal summoned him. Let's negate it. Yeah, GG. Alright, we're going to the next match. Okay, go in second with a decent hand, decent hand, actually not even just decent, it's a really good hand. If we can make the right Ash play, then we should be good. What is he using? Should we Ash this? I feel like we should Ash this. Do we want him to draw? Nah. Because if he's using that first, he's probably trying to bait it out, but I think that's still a good decision if we Ash it. Let's see what he's doing. He can still make plays for sure. What deck is this? Draconic Diagram. I haven't... No way. Um, is this... What's that one? Uh, this is True J true King, True Draco? Or is this a... I don't know what, the, what deck this is, honestly. Don't know what deck this is. Let's see what he does. I think if I want to bait out the Ash, I'm going to use this first. Then I'm going to activate this. Also, depending on what we draw next turn, right? So he added something that I forgot to click. True Draco Heritage. Okay, he's using True Draco. Okay, makes sense. Make or True Draco. I don't even know. In the comments, tell me what it is. True Draco or True Draco? I don't know. Now, we'll let him do his turn, and then we'll just get to our turn. Okay, it's our turn. We're now drawing. Ooh. <laughs> what does this do? Once we turn, when your opponent activates a card or effect while you can control this tribute summoned monster, you can take one true Draco or from your deck. And if you. What? Does it negate it? Once per turn, when your opponent activates a card or effect while you control this tribute summoned monster, you can take one true Draco or true, Ch true king continuous trap from your deck and either activate it or add it to your hand. Okay, okay. Let's see. I'm going to try to bait it out with this. I'm going to try. Let's see. Okay. He can activate this. He's going to tribute. Okay. Let's see what he does. Which trap card will he bring? Can't be anything too crazy. At least it's not going to be anything to stop us. If it's an imperm. Oh, no. Never mind. It can't. It's a true Jaco thing. Yeah. <laughs> never mind. If this card is okay, you can lead to one. Okay, 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 okay. During the opponent's main phase, you can immediately have this tribute summon it. Okay, well, I don't know. Let's go here. I 
Okay. Negate the effects of all. This card is the only card you have in your extra deck. That's very unfortunate. This card only. You have no extra deck in your. Okay. Can he OTK us? I don't think he can. Okay, this is fine. Who? Hmm. What do we want to do here? Honestly, I might just Lightning Storm. If he just gets rid of us, we'll just Lightning Storm. Let's add... You. Why not? Why do we add you? Because we're just going to send him to the graveyard anyway. Yeah, we can add you. I mean you. Good. Oh, I kind of wish... Into the Karibo. Our effects are negated anyway. Let's just see what he can do. I don't think he can OTK us. Well, depending on what he draws right here. Jono, send this card to the graveyard. During the end phase, if you control no tribute summon monsters. Well, he's just going to go into his battle phase. What does he set? What is this? Okay. I see what he's saying. Level 5. I don't think he can OTK here. Unless he can, and I'm just stupid. I didn't pay attention to- Oh, if he brings out another one of this. Then your main phase, are you okay? This is not good. I don't want him to set because he probably has three of these. This is gonna be tough. This is going to be tough. He's setting it. He set another one. No! Set in the main phase too, please. Okay, now, now we're just looking rough, honestly. Now we're actually just looking rough. Good thing we didn't add it to the hand, right? I don't know. Because then he's just going to set it. Oh, no. Because even if he activates it, it is a good. This is a good play. Lightning Storm. I think this is a good play. Because he can just activate this and he's just going to set it. Or activate it right here. What does this do? Don't know what that does. Your special summon in defense position for the rest of the turn. Cannot special summon, okay. That's fine. Well, good thing he didn't activate this, because then it would have just been destroyed. Why well, you control this, okay. He gets to destroy a monster, I think. Or does he have to destroy? I don't know. Let's see what he's thinking. Okay, now we're, we're looking good. We're looking pretty good here. Okay, we're going to add the Ben 10. Then the Gamma, that's fine. And he gets to activate this. I really, really don't want him to activate that trap card. Because like I said, he probably has three in the in the deck. Okay. I guess that's fine. We add the Ben 10. Should I make a Natasha play here? I could Natasha. He can still activate this. Unless he's going to try to destroy it with this and then destroy a card on my field. I don't think it matters because I have the Gamma in the graveyard. Okay, good. 
Tribute Ben 10, add the Ben 10. Let's add this. Honestly, I could just attack both of these with the level four, with the level 12. See. Add the Ben 10 to the hand. Should I, should I just go into the... Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go into... The ultimate is right now. Just in case he has something to activate. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's see. This is fine. We put it in attack. This is our other turn, so turn four. So we can just probably try to win this turn. So now we can negate whatever he tries to do if we have he has something. Hey, what are you doing? This card, you target one true Jaco. Card you control, destroy, and if you do, that's it. I thought he would have done something crazier, honestly. Honestly. Okay, destroy you. Perfect. That's fine. Why would he activate that now? That's my question. Don't know. Okay, we're gonna add... Should we Natasha him? <laughs> we could Natasha. Yeah, let's Natasha him. Let's try it. Okay, bring you. Now let's go here. Then we'll go into the Mu Beta. Or do we want to do that? Do we want to do that check? We have to make a smart decision here. Gee, let's see. Because we could do a lot of things from here. We could go into you or... We go into you. Mm. Let's see. Let's see. What do we do? Yeah, we'll go into the Natasha. I think we just win here. I think we just win here. We'll send the... Yeah. Activate you, because we'll have enough on the field. So yeah, we, we should just win here. This is perfect. Now we're looking really good. It's looking like a GG solid. Special summon the Natasha. Oh, I don't even have to use one from the goddamn the deck, but we use one from the, the card, I mean. Perfect. Gonna gain some life points because we lost some. Natasha is just such a good card, it's not even funny. And we're going to go into this guy. No. We're going to keep him. Give it the ultimateness. One, two, three, four. We're here. Then we Natasha steal, and then we should win. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. That's the tech. That is the tech. Perfect. 
Perfect. Getting 1500, right? How much do we get? 1500? Nice! Now we just attack for game. We're just gonna be toxic, cause we're toxic. Attacking with every single one before we actually do it. Alright, GG. GG. We're going to the next one. Okay, we get to go first. And we have both. Both in hand. But we can still make our plays. We can still make the plays. Yeah, I don't know. Max C, huh? We'll let him draw. We should let him draw, right? I think. No, I forgot. We have this. Perfect. If it was turn two, I wouldn't have cared, but Maxi could be really bad for us. Okay. Yeah, we're going to do this. Data. Perfect. Going to the Link Karibo. Like I said, the best, <laughs> best card in this deck. Link Karibo. It comes in clutch a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Okay, now we can activate the Zeta. Drawing both of these really does hurt us a little bit, but not too much. Activate, bring you. We're gonna activate Ben 10, then we're gonna add the Diviner. Normal summon. Send the Herald. Uh, GG. <laughs> GG. GG. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm gonna the next video is probably gonna be a Cyber Dragon video, so we're gonna still have more Drytron videos for sure, but next one is gonna be Cyber Dragon because I wanna do more gameplay on. And I would make more decks, but like I said, I have no <laughs> I have no uh materials to make anything else. Like this is I'm working on this right now. The Red Dragon Archfiend, but we'll see. I might have to just get rid of these three, honestly. I don't need that. But yeah, this, I just need the extra deck, and it's just a lot of URs. I don't have any UR token. I'll have to get rid of some decks, but it's for the YouTube, you know, for the YouTube. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, hit that like button, comment, share, subscribe, all that stuff. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.